it's time for a brand new universe pack and I haven't done one of these in a little while so I thought I'd bring them back and just different characters with a new series and I select my own little characters and you know characters I think deserve to be in the game they have so many different characters that they could pick as usual just like I say I always say there's so many different variety of characters and then with these different shows I always try to go into three different worlds and some of the characters and some of the shows that I don't think many people talk about and I also mix them in with some of the shows that I grew up watching and um, with this particular pack today that I want to talk about these three characters I think are unique and I think will be a good addition to the roster and uh, I don't know can I say they're fan favorites I'm not too sure but one in particular I'm going to get ready to start with before I do let's go to the roster so everybody can see the characters in the game but I just think that some people they play favorites with certain characters and when it comes to different shows that come on and they air I wanted to select at least two or maybe three at the most at least more than one character but I would say at the most at least one character that could be underrated and can be able to shine and a not a character that's not really brought to the table often and brought up by Nickelodeon fans select your fighter and just for starters I'm gonna select I'm gonna start with Sheen from Jimmy Neutron I definitely want to see Jimmy Neutron in the game and we already got one Jimmy Neutron rock a uh, rep with you Neutron getting into the game the model looks good and I can definitely tell that whichever character that they add and choose to add next after Rocco, whoever it is, is going to look just as good as all the characters do in this game. It's just the character models, the colors, it's just the pictures itself. Everything's just very well done. And it just looks clean. Just all the different models. And Sheen, as the best, I selected him as an additional Jimmy Neutron rep to join into the roster. For this universe pack today as the first character one of three characters i'm going to be able to talk about and i know he has his own show i watched planet sheen i haven't seen all the episodes and i'm not one of those uh, who memorizes every single line and all the different the different things that go on did y'all see that look i've never seen this happen this must be a new glitch it's as if it's supposed to be an old Rocco character. See this? Very weird. I've never seen this happen. Probably from the latest update. See, it doesn't even show it. The question mark is not even coming up now. Yeah, this is a new bug. It's just empty. An empty slot. I don't know what's going on. Let's put keep it on a character. But let's just keep it on Rocco. This is the latest character that we got so far. But anyway, that just kind of threw me off track. But Sheen, I think he's one of the characters that I um, I would like to see in the game. And just I was trying to say, I don't remember all the episodes and all the things that happened. But I haven't seen all the different episodes of Planet Sheen. I think it was a pretty good show. And I'm not talking about the Planet Sheen or just that version of Sheen can get into the game. That can be a particular, maybe a potential alternate skin. His Planet Sheen outfit as a costume or alternate skin just one of many skins that he can have and then his Archer Lord mask could be one too but I think Sheen is one of my favorite characters from Jimmy Neutron and so many other characters that I like from the show itself and um, just his voice lines he's goofy and um, they did have that episode where he was very smart he was a little bit too smart and uh, he went evil so they can definitely maybe play around with that sort of version of him to make him really unlock his potential as a fighter and a playable character in this roster so Sheen is just one of my favorites from Jimmy Neutron I like seeing him and just just this goofiness Archer Lord and I can just be one of his voice lines for sure referencing Archer Lord because he that's his favorite hero and he wears the shirt and stuff like that so um I think he'll be a good a good character I want to definitely see him shine and get in and get a spotlight yeah he has just again he has his own show but I think he can definitely deserve a spot and he deserves a spot in the roster as a playable character and uh, i'm curious to see what you guys think i'm sure not everybody likes Sheen, which is completely fine but i i picked him as my first character for this universe pack 
But um, I hope to see more Jimmy Neutron reps. Not even just Jimmy Neutron. Of course, I want to see him next for sure in the next pack. But I hope to see many other Jimmy Neutron characters get into the game because they have a lot of other characters with potential like Sheen. But let's get into our next character, a completely different show. I know it's a little girly. You know, I think I know some people out there have watched the show and I've seen some of you, some of you guys from Nickelodeon Kart Racers 3 that came over here uh, talking about this character and how you guys want to see her in Kart Racers 3. But I think what if she was in Nickelodeon All-Star Ball to be able to shine? Ginger Foutley is the second character I'm, I'm selecting as told by Ginger, another show that isn't really brought up in the NCU and many fans in Nickelodeon usually talk about Spongebob, Ninja Turtles, and the Loud House, Avatar, you know, a little bit of Danny Phantom, and sometimes My Life as a Teenage Robot, Jimmy Neutron, and so much more. Ginger is one of the characters that I think would be a little bit different, and they can get more. Uh, it's another different character that can make the, the roster unique. And just another show that's not represented in the game and I really think that she can be able to shine in the game so just a little bit of ideas to throw out there she got some school supplies that she can use and utilize for offense and more to really be able to go crazy some makeup I'm assuming to what I did with Trixie Tang when I mentioned from a while back from the other pack with Trixie Tang for fairly odd parents can be able to get in but Ginger Frotley I think would be another good unique selection and I put her in my pack because I like the show I like the character the the intro is pretty cool too there's other characters and friends that she meets for her classmates and the friends that she hangs out with it almost is like a dorm room a dorm room something like that or roommates that she hangs out with you know after school so I selected Ginger Foutley to be a potential character to be able to shine in the roster and uh Maybe they can make that happen. That's just another additional choice for the developers from a show. Another different show to stack up the roster. Another show that's not really brought up very often from fans. And that's why I put her into the universe pack to make it a little bit different. And just to wrap up, I have so much to say about this character next. We're heading back into the world of Fairly Up here. It's just I was just really recently talking about with uh, Trixie Tang. I'm selecting... I'm gonna go Crash Nebula to wrap up the universe pack, and every it, it can it can go t as far as saying most people. I always just say I prefer Crimson Chan over Crash Nebula, but this was another hero from Timmy Turner from the show. If you guys remember, Crash Nebula was also brought up, and he even dressed up like Crash Nebula in his little costume with the white and blue costume. And uh, I think he had a super, the superpowers as well. Where he used to be able to go fast like him. I don't know. I don't know. I think it was some kind of episode when he had superpowers like Crash Nebula. But, or was he in his world, in his comic book? Could have it mixed up with Crimson Chan. But Cra Crash Nebula was on the serial box. He was in the comics. Just another one, just an additional hero from Timmy Turner. People don't talk about Crash Nebula as, as often as Crimson Chan. Here comes the Crimson Chan. I like him more. But Crash Nebula was just as good as uh, Crimson Chan. And I just put him in it. Just just another character people just don't really talk about that much. And Crash Nebula got all those different abilities. Those gadgets. That blaster. And he was even playing. He was even playing the video game. That's the episode I was looking about. We're going to think about. The the episode when he was playing a video game of Crash Nebula instead of studying that's funny but I like that I like that episode it's one of my favorites just to reminisce but it's just it just shows that the the character potential behind him and just with all the different abilities he can fly he's strong and different gadgets that he can use he got way more gadgets than Crimson Chan Crimson Chan is just fly you don't have no gadgets or anything like that and his big old chin that's what he got but Crash Nebula got way more tools and different toys that he can play and use in a battle to really just unleash some good offense on the field with these characters. And I can just imagine some of the abilities he can have. I would like to see Crash Nebula versus Powder Toast Man. Powder Toast Man! Something like that. 
that'll be a cool little showdown. Crash Nebula versus Potter Tozman, Danny Phantom, and just the roster in general. So even if they can't get Timmy Turner, you've got all these different options from the show itself to be able to get represented from Fairly Odd Parents from that particular universe. So I'm hoping that he will barely get in, or maybe someone from his show. It's just so many different things that they can really do with him, with all the different gadgets that he can do. And with his blaster, I forgot what it's called, but I would like to see that shine. And then his character model. You look all cartoony, but just look at these characters just again. They look really good and very well done and just colorful. Crash Nebula will have a nice character model visually and just characters like Sandy. They just all look great. I just like how they really develop the character models. Everything looks very well done. And just imagining Crash Nebula, Sheen, and Ginger getting into the game. All three of those characters are going to look good. So, um, this is just a just another additional pack that I wanted to bring out today. And I know, I just again, I haven't done one for a while. But I'm hoping that we do get another pack soon. Maybe get some news about what's coming to the game. What's their future plans for the rest of the year we still got a whole nother month because december is getting closer and closer i think it's almost time for maybe a new update or maybe some kind of post of what's going on with the game what their plans are going into the new year i hope there's more and then these three characters are just the beginning sheen ginger and crash nebula these are just three characters from three different shows but jimmy neutron Fairy Loud Parents and As Told by Ginger, three different shows that can get in to, to stack up the roster for just a different variety of characters. Characters that are not really brought up, very underrated characters and shows that people haven't probably even heard of As Told by Ginger. I think she's definitely a good character. It's just another like, another, another likable show from the NCU and um, just a different variety of characters that can really be able to get in to shine. But uh, I hope there's more. I hope we can definitely get some more updates. And uh, as far as their plans, it's so much more that they can bring to the game outside of just characters, more modes. Crossplay is still missing. Well, crossplay is still supposedly supposed to be on the way. But I'm just not sure what's going on. So I hope there is another universe pack. And then these three characters I mentioned can just only be the beginning. Of just even more content for the game and even more characters people can get excited about and try out and give a chance.